Hi everyone, welcome to Kids Can Cook. My name is Daniel Davies, and today for our recipe we'll be cooking Japanese fried noodles yakisoba. But before I get started, let's introduce our guests. Hi everyone. Hi. You guys ready to cook? Yes. But what do we have to do before we get started? Wash out! Okay everyone, now that you have nice clean hands, I'll tell you what today's recipe will be. Today we're making Japanese stir-fried yakisoba noodles. The ingredients will be as follows. For our stir-fry, we'll be using pork, cabbage, carrot, and capsicum, which will all be added into a large bowl. And we'll be adding noodles as our main ingredient. And when all our made ingredients are added into a large bowl, we'll be using a special Japanese Worcester sauce to help with the seasoning. Okay everybody, before we get to the cooking part, we first need to make sure that we cut up all our ingredients. But for our fellow young kids out there, please ask an adult to help you when using a knife. For our Chinese Hokkien noodles, we will just put them in the large big pot of water for only 30 seconds as they are pre-cooked. When our noodles are done, we will just pour out all the water and transfer them into another bowl ready for our stir fry. So we'll just put a bit of vegetable oil into the pan so that the ingredients will not stick to the pan. All right, everybody. Are you ready to add all our ingredients together? That's good. Let's get started. First, we'll start off with the meat. The best results, after every single ingredient you cook, make sure you separate it into different bowls. After our meat is cooked, we'll add in our cabbage now. After our cabbage is cooked, we'll add in our red and green capsicum. For our final ingredient of the whole of the vegetables, we'll just add the remainder of the carrots. Make sure you give all your vegetables a good mixture for the best results. Then we'll just add our pork to the rest of our vegetables for extra flavor. Make sure you add a bit of your poison sauce to it to add for a maximum of flavor. We'll add our noodles and then mix everything together. We'll add a little bit more of our Worcester sauce to add a bit more flavor to the noodles. Okay everyone, our noodles are ready. Who's ready to eat? Me! That's good. Here you go.
Alright everybody, our noodles are a success. What can we do? 